You know, I just uh, warmed up a couple times two nights ago. Just didn't feel like his arm was getting loose. I think, you know, Danny's pitched a ton this year. And usually when you're left-handed reliever, there's nights when you get up and maybe you don't get used. And um, so he's just had a heavy workload so far this year. He's just got a little bit of soreness. We're going to um, give him a couple of weeks, and hopefully he'll be back right off when the I.L. stints over. Uh, we no noticed yesterday in the notes that you had um, – and undecided for Saturday, yeah. And then Bradis for um, for for Sunday. Are you trying to, um, you know, stretch guys out, give guys extra rest when you can? Yeah. yeah. So uh, I think Cole Irvin is going to be a probable Saturday, um, and that, and for that reason, we're going to try to give guys extra days as we go along here. Try to keep our starting pitching as fresh as possible. Um, we have a long stretch in September after a couple off days at the end of this month. So we're going to do our best we can to kind of monitor innings and workload and, and keep guys, these guys as healthy as possible uh, these next 48, 48 games. I know you have a couple off days before Oakland and, and after and coming up, but um, is there any chance that you guys could go to a six-man rotation moving forward? Yeah, I mean, we're going to slide Cole in there for Saturday and then, uh, you know, if – Best case scenario, everybody stays healthy. Everything, um, our bullpen stays intact, and you know I think we would definitely look into that. Giving Cole more starts, um, you just kind of never know, and things happen quickly. But that would be that would that's kind of our plan right now is to to insert Cole there, um, to just give guys extra days. What have you been hearing about Tyler Wells? I just actually was just texting with him this morning, and he feels like. Uh, um, he feels really good, and I think this break is, was huge for him. And uh, he's going to throw against Saturday, and so he had a week, you know, a week rest in between. Um, might throw a few more pitches to kind of just keep, keep him ready. But uh, doing a lot of mechanical work, backing off his throwing, things like that, just to hopefully be, he's a big part of a uh, big part of our team down the stretch. Part of the thinking with the six man, not just the workloads, but also. You have Wells in Double A. You've got Means on a rehab assignment. Does that play a factor as well? Yeah, we're going to kind of see where we are. You know, after Tyler throws this next time, and then, you know, it's pretty much we're we're kind of coming down the stretch here. So we're kind of day to day, kind of a little bit on everything, waiting to see when guys are going to be ready. Um, but as of right now, we want to give some of our rotation guys some extra days, and so uh, that's why we're putting Cole in there. As well as Billy still. Yeah, I think he's going to be in Richmond. Is that right? Special is it when guys get the ten years of service time, be able to share moments with them. Yeah, that's one of the, that's a it's such an incredible accomplishment, and to uh, I think every guy that has ten years in, uh, they remind everybody that it goes by really fast, and it uh, feels like yesterday that they were they were uh, you know a rookie in the in the big leagues, but um, to be able to stay in this game in this league for ten years. Is, it takes an incredible amount of talent and determination and, um, you know, will and a lot, you know, have to be a good makeup guy. There's a lot of things that have to go really, really well and says a lot about their character, honestly. And th those two guys are fantastic um, clubhouse guys, fantastic leaders. Um, and they've had, you know, they've had good careers and, and it was fun to celebrate with them yesterday.